What's up guys, I'm Scott from Romaru and today I wanna to talk to you about how to make shadows on your photos totally pop. That's right, I'm gonna tell you a little secret. Some of the shadows that people show in their photos, ours as well, aren't real. So I'm gonna show you how to make those shadows look like real amazing shadows and you can fake some of those photos to make it look like you got up early for sunrise or that perfect golden hour at sunset and that shadow is just stretched out as far as can see. So let's get started. All right, starting out, we have our photo in Photoshop. And first thing you're gonna do is remove the layer from the background and then duplicate that layer. It's pretty standard practice with any photos you bring into Photoshop. Next, we're gonna use the quick selection tool, which will help us highlight these two lovely people, my beautiful wife and myself. So as you can see, this amazing tool, you just click the spots and it slowly highlights all the areas you want. And if you get something you don't like, hold down the option on the Mac and then click and it will remove the areas that you didn't want to highlight. Next, we're going to right click and select layer via copy. And so what that does, it creates a duplicate layer of just the area that we've selected. And so this layer will become our shadow. And next, duplicate that layer and move it to the top of all the different layers. Now highlight one of those layers and go to Layer, New Fill, Solid Color. And then you'll see that it turns the entire layer black. And that is what our shadow is. And so then Command-T and then right click and select Skew. And here we're going to start stretching this to make it look a little bit more like a shadow. So I stretch this a little more. Now let's show, okay, so now you can see Look at this, it's starting to look like a shadow, but those are just a little too dark and solid. So this is, now we have to stretch the feet to match where the feet start. And then stretch that out, really make it look like it's early morning. And so the problem with these shadows, you can see, shadows in real life aren't that solid. They don't have that perfect of an edge. And so in these next few steps, we're going to kind of soften it and blur it to make it look like a real shadow. Select that layer. Now go to Filter, Blur, Motion Blur. And I'm going to set this angle at about 45. And you can see it's starting to blur that shadow just a little bit. Okay, and for one of the last parts, we're going to click on the layer, create a mask for that layer and then go click on our gradient tool and just drag it down. It may take a few times, but it starts to soften that. And now it's starting to look like a real shadow. So you can see there. Okay, now zooming in, you can see we have a little bit of extra shadow that we just need to clean up. And just simple eraser tool. Should be able to clean that up very nicely. And this is, this is so zoomed in that no one's gonna really be able to see you know, these errors at this point. And that's basically it. And as you can see, adding those shadows really makes the image just mm, pop. And this photo was actually taken, uh, let's say, it's probably about mid-morning, so we didn't have really stark shadows, but it wasn't that early morning where the shadows just stretched out. But now, we've taken a photo that was okay and just whoosh, cranked it up. So now, I hope you guys like this. If you have any questions, comments, let me know, like, subscribe. Thanks so much, bye.